Austin. Great. It's kind of ridiculous yeah. to be sitting across from this man. He's like, yeah, I'm a returning yeah, champion. You <laughs> pour the champagne glass. Did you just spray the champagne? I did. I sprayed the champagne. Yeah. Very, very good. Yeah. Well, Brian, let's first of all talk about your situation because you're back and congratulations from last year. Thanks. But you are reunited with Victor Brick. You say it's been a while. Yeah, we haven't seen each other since this time. Really? So I was and does he look any different? <laughs> Whole new man, way, way more handsome, sexy, yes. you know, yeah. together, Brian, focused. Brian Austin Green, you have not changed. You are so alive, so vibrant. Your energy when I last saw you back in the day with uh, Ricardo Diaz from the Mañana and the in the Morning Show on Sister Station, Kiss FM. You were, you were just out there, crazy man, but now there's a serenity attached to you. You seem very serene and tranquil. I'm married and settled. I have a son that loves me, he calls me dad and he means it, you know, so I, I, I love my wife and my family and this is all just fun, you know, I don't take it all so seriously. You know what he wants, he wants, he has his beautiful son, he needs a daughter. So I do, absolutely. He needs I want a little girl. That's, yes. That's my next I'm sure you make it with a beautiful girl. girl, no doubt about that. Yeah, you're trying. <laughs> As who wouldn't? Absolutely. Well, first of all, Brian, you're back. B H E. B H E. Uh, yes. And, and now you're riding with the pros. Yeah. How does that feel? It's rough. <laughs> it's rough at the back of the pack. Um, I'm hoping that we don't take each other out before we get up to the celebrities. You know? It's safe to lose the entire thing at the very back, 30 seconds behind everyone. So we're we're trying to pace ourselves. We had a little trouble today in practice, but. Uh, we're going to qualify well, we're going to stay away from each other, um, we're going to try and keep it healthy and smart. Very smart out there. Well, of course, he gets some tips from uh, Ryan here, of course, at the Fitty Champion. Uh, champion, uh, champion, champion, champion. Yeah. We've known about this great history here in Long Beach and so many legendary drivers have uh, won on the streets of Long Beach. Well, what did this victory mean for you last year? Uh, it's like a good one. There we go. That's what I was saying. Yes, thank you. Brian Hunter, Brian. Um, yeah, thanks. It was huge on so many levels. This is a track that I've been watching since I was a kid. and you know, I came here with my dad watched my heroes win here. And uh, Long Beach is special for so many reasons, but uh, it's really hard to get it right. Uh, you know, it, to win this race, it, it is really tough. Long Beach is one of the toughest to get right. So, so what makes uh, Long Beach unique about the street races? What is it about this course that presents the biggest challenge? It's the curves, too. You know, you got, really got to attack the curves. And in our cars, with very little suspension movement, it's really violent in the car. Um, and you got to put 700 horsepower down on the way out of the corner. So it's, you it's, guys you it's should run the science. I pull my hair that, out that running that problem. <laughs> that problem. Yeah. Done. Yeah, with, with the front wheel drive. Yeah, no, they're great on the curves. Yeah. No, Ryan, this, 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 this year, <laughs> instead of being the hunter, as we were last year, when, when you were in the whole thing, now you're the hunter. Is that going to change your technique in the streets? It, it's not. I mean, you can't get the place in an Indy car right now because it's, uh, it's as tough as it's ever been, if not tougher. And um, the second you just wait a little bit, thinking something owes you something, you're, you're going to be going to be in the back, so it's tough. I think it's like from first to, to tenth or twelfth right now is, is three or four tenths of a second. It's tight. Really tight. Now you, now you, oh, that's tons of room. That's tons of room right there. Now, now you had a steer at Indianapolis. Yeah. Yeah. Now, what the hell happened? Yeah. Ran out of fuel. That's not a good thing to do. No. <laughs> that's yeah. number one on the list. Don't run out of fuel. Right. Uh, came down into turn three on the second to last lap and ran out of fuel and finally went over my, my left rear and flew into the fence. And Runway had it worse. I, I I was close to having a real problem there with my head because he came down on me. Uh, but he had to be out of practice. He's not good. He's back in the car now, thank God. You gotta drive fearlessly, you gotta drive smart, but you gotta you gotta go for it. How do you, how do you uh, really uh, dissect that degree between fearlessness you know, and stupidity? It's, that's the constant juggle. Yeah, Every you session. Know. <laughs> yeah, you know. There's such a fine line between hero and zero around some of these places that it's, uh, that's why you Sometimes you are the hero, sometimes you are the hero. Yeah, we see every year in the celebrity race, Brian. Maybe the first couple laps were okay, but once they start mixing it up, yeah. last year we had a, a lot of carnage out there. Fun, wasn't it? It was, and it yeah. just got more heated. Yeah. And I know you, you get in that car and suddenly... Obviously we didn't pay for the cars. So. No, you know that. And I don't worry about the damage and everything else. Yeah. But, I mean, as, as you were driving out there last year, and it's been a while because you were in this race many years ago. 13 years. Yeah, yeah. so you were back with... But what is it like just from, you know, a novice to get out there and really race? It's, it's 
really, I don't know if it's the same for, for you, but you literally get in the car and you just run your heart out and, you know, see how you finish. It's not, I, I'm not really thinking that far in advance as I'm going. I'm literally just trying to stay on my lines, not make mistakes, not look in my mirrors, um, you know, just do what I'm doing and, and hope that I somehow end up on top of you. Now, we, do you guys, Ryan, do you do like, we, we always tell the celebrities from experience, that rear view mirror, turn it down. On the side mirrors, yeah, but this mirror, you start staring at people behind you, you dead because you're going to miss your marks and everything else. But we don't have I actually, that You don't have anything. We I don't should have take the mirror. side mirrors away. I don't, I do I don't even look at mirrors. That's the worst thing, mirrors. Yeah. Once you start looking at them, you miss your points, you miss yeah. your brake points. If you get the mirrors right now, I want to transmit a great transmission of tranquility yeah. to both of you guys. Perfect. Ryan Hunter Ray, defending champion, and Brian Austin. To be the champion. Take the bamboo. Feel the power. 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 Feel the